That'll be Noah Lug Ludwig out of Iowa on the pole for our first heat and jumping out to the lead. It's H.J. Col Colburn out of Stockton running second behind Ludwig. Mike Traskowski moves up to the fourth spot in the 23T. Everybody's to oh, spin over in two. And we'll stay green. As everybody paced by the 76 of Noah Ludwig out of Logan, Iowa. He's been at the front since the get. H.J. Colburn out of Stockton running. Second as they come around for the white flag, but he's got company behind as Traskowski in fourth, pulling up behind Madden in the two. The race belongs to Ludwig, but it's going to be a three-way battle for the second spot. As the 10 C of H.J. Colburn will take the second spot. On the pole for heat number two will be the 68 of Garrett Hager. Rock Beater in 48 on the outside will get the green flag this time around. Tommy Fos in the 27 inside of row number two along with Jason Fusselman out of Shelby, Iowa. On row number two, Fos goes to the third spot. Fusselman back to the fourth spot. The leaders we come out of four continues to be the 48 of Brock Beater. All the way out of Minot, North Dakota, by the way. Foes will drop out to the front. It'll be the 68 then of Garrett Hager in second. Foes is at third, and now in the 55, it's going to be Fusselman jumping to the inside, looking for the fourth spot from Madden in the two. Fos continues to hold the third spot, but not for long as he gets high, may drop two more spots, and he will again. He'll get shuffled back to fifth as Fusselman comes to the inside and may lose another spot, but is able to get back out in front of Russ Specht in the 26 out of Hastings, Nebraska. But that didn't last long.
Two laps to go, continues to be Brock Peters' race. As he's gotten the jump out on the 68 of Hager, who's third, then a stretch back to third, back to fourth, and really that's where the race is for fourth, fifth, and sixth, but that's starting to spread out as Beater will come to the line for the white flag. And your winner out of Minot, North Dakota, Brock Beater. Ron Whaling in the 007 will be outside of row number two. They'll bring it around for the green flag. Kurt Hansen in the 75 dives to the inside, now pops back to the outside as Emin slow, Fonensteel slow. And finally, it'll settle out to have a four-way battle for the lead after one lap around. Luke Fonensteel in the 5X heads into the pits, your new leader is going to be Dylan Thompson out of Hastings, Nebraska to the top spot. Whaling moves up to second in the 007. That's going to drop the 88M of TC McCain back to third, and he'll go back to fourth as he gets passed by the 75 of Kurt Hansen out of Walnut, Iowa. Brian Stitch in the 21, making his move. He's going to jump up to the fourth spot, getting around McCain. He's on the fourth spot, looking for the top three. Emmons is back to sixth. Dylan Thompson out of Hastings, Nebraska, continues to show the way. And everybody's starting to settle down just a little bit and spread out as Whaling in the 007 is in second, followed up by the 75 of Kurt Hansen out of Walnut, Iowa. That's really about the only battle on the track inside the top five. It is the only battle for the top five right now. Two to go, as Thompson looks to the inside in his third spot. This will be the final lap. Really about one position to be determined. Thompson looks to the inside, can't find anything. Ron Whaling in the 007 pulls away a bit. That'll be the only battle on the track, but it'll be decided in turn three. It'll be Dan Pittman out of Grand Island, Nebraska in the third, moving for the third spot. Three wide as Graham goes to the inside. Brand new race car, and he'll back off just a little bit, settle back into the fifth spot as he falls in behind of Darren Unrein in the 09D, and now some contact as moving from fifth to fourth is going to be Graham. The 2J of Jason McClung out of Goodland is in the sixth spot. He leads the second pack 
But the man on the move now is Dan Pittman out of Grand Island from third, now battling for second inside the 45. Your leader continues to be Swart in the 54. The 54P of Pfeiffer continues to lead the way. We have a car leaving the pit. That'll be the 43B. Chip Brodus heading into the pits from Woodward, Oklahoma. Pfeiffer in the 54P continues to lead. The 45, your runner up, and then look at the battle for the third spot. As Graham has the middle position, he'll hold that spot. Well, he'll get shuffled back to fourth. And it becomes even tighter as we're looking for the top spot. Now here comes Graham from the middle of the pack. He'll move to the inside of the 45 behind Piper. One, two, and then three wide for your top six spots. One to go. Darren Unrein in the 09D, he looks to the outside. He may try to shoot the middle here as now Graham goes to the inside of the 45. He'll take over the second spot. The plus one of Dan Pittman, he'll go down deep to the inside and here we come to the line. 